Hi, I'm Parker Allen, filling in for Randy Reed, who is on a much-deserved vacation. It's Today in Lighting, Friday, 10 May, and we are sponsored by Novaplex, from concept to completion with ease, speed, and quality. As always, you can find the latest episode and subscribe at todayinlighting.com. Here are the stories making news. In the first quarter of 2024, Legrand faced a 5.6% decline in sales due to a shrinking building market, yet maintained a strong margin of 20.5%. Despite lower net profit, acquisitions and innovation efforts continue as the company maintains its 2024 targets. Read the full report on edisonreport.com. In the latest issue of LM&M, we profile Everlights, a leader in lamp recycling and sustainability. Founded in 1995, they've expanded to include new lighting sales, emphasizing sustainability in all operations and earning certifications for their commitment to environmental stewardship. You can find that article on edisonreport.com and look for a story from them on the logistics of lamp recycling in the upcoming issue of LM&M. Brightview Technologies introduces its polycarbonate brightness enhancing film stack, boosting display brightness by up to 30%. Engineered for desktop monitors, laptops, and more, this film stack ensures efficiency and advanced optics. Visit edisonreport.com to learn more. The Net Zero Lighting Conference took place in London last week and emphasized the importance of a holistic approach to achieve sustainability in the lighting industry. Key messages included cultural shifts within organizations, data-driven strategies, and the importance of certification schemes. Read more on designinglighting.com. And yesterday was a good day for the markets. The NASDAQ was up 43, the Dow was up 331, and both Dialyte and Orion gained almost 3%. That's it. Go light up the world. Have a great Friday and pray for peace.